Jeff Frick here with theCUBE. We are on the ground in downtown San Francisco at the Spark Summit 2015. Spark is like the hottest technology that everybody's talking about. I think this is the third year of Spark Summit. They've got Spark Summit East, Spark Summit West. And uh, so we wanted to come up and get a feel for what's going on. We're excited to be joined by this next segment by Rishi Yada from InfoAdjux. Hello. Hi, and Jeff, glad to be here. Yeah, so a week ago we sat down at Hadoop Summit in San Jose. A lot of people are confused. What's the story with Spark relative to Hadoop? So Hadoop, uh, uh, it started as the, as the first big data platform, right? So Hadoop was synonymous to big data. But now uh, Hadoop, especially SDFS, that has become more of a storage thing. And the compute is where the actual game is being played, right? So in that, uh, Spark is one compute platform in which you can do everything. It's a one unified single runtime. Right. right. And, and, and you can see the traction. It's, it's an amazing traction here we are we are so glad to be here at uh, at the spark summit so that so that's interesting from a technology point of view what are you seeing out in the in the field with customers are they behind it are they hearing about it are they doing PLCs what what uh, what do you see with your customer base you know, customers love it because uh, it's all about analytics right so and spark lets you do analytics uh, in very very with very very low latency you're talking about sub second latency here right. right so with the Hadoop what happened was the customers were able to store petabytes of the data uh, in a very cost-effective manner but now they want to access that data you want they want to process they want to analyze that data within seconds right. and that's what spark provides right it's this whole concept of a data pipeline right versus a data store and really starting to build applications around that data pipeline in the access in real time and we're hearing that the latency is just ridiculously fast oh yeah latency is I mean yeah there is it's very very low latency and especially what I'm excited most about is the announcement they made today uh, in fact yesterday about the project tungsten right which is going to take the sparks uh, performance to a new level right I mean it's, it's, it's spark and the, if you see the uh, details of the project tungsten that that's that's going to make spark super super fast yeah. from what it already is so so how's it impact your business uh, new technology a lot of excitement uh, new uptake a lot of PLCs people sub subbing out a dupe or is it really all new new workloads uh, well, it's, it's a combination of old workloads and new workloads as we talked uh, last week also. So most of the work will still be in the uh, old workloads. But uh, for us it's music to our ears because we provide the people and we provide uh, the advisory and we provide the troubleshooting. So we provide whatever is between knowing about Spark at the summit, what Spark does and what you see in the live in the production, right? right. So, so we, so we provide, the, we fill the gap between the two. All right. Well, Rishi, I'll let you get back to the booth. There's a lot of action going on here, but I like it. Music to his ears. Rishi Adav, thanks for stopping by. Thanks for having me, Jeff. Absolutely. So I'm Jeff Frick. You're watching the Cube. We're at Spark Summit 2015 in downtown San Francisco. Thanks for watching.